Hello, this is Robin. I just did a Keeping It Real series, and it was about unruly kids. I want to just add a little bit. Um, no matter what some parents do, how they raise their children with respect and love, and rules and regulations. There's some kids that just don't get it. And I understand that. I wasn't trying to mean, you know, that if you raise your kids the way you think you should, that they're not gonna grow up and still, you know, go away from the way they were raised because they do, they do. You know, no matter how much love you give them, no matter how much attention you give them, they still just don't, you know, they, they may listen at home and be respectful until they get to a certain age and they get around other kids and there's peer pressure and no matter how much love or attention that you give them, they do veer off, you know, they wander off in their own way and they may end up getting herself into trouble. And I'm not trying to say that that was Jens's fault. Um, I've been there, I know, you know, I've been, I've had experience with, um, you know, I don't want to go into details, but believe me, I did what I could do and you know there was still problems that I had to deal with with the cops and um, you know getting them getting into trouble and doing things that they weren't raised to do so I just wanted to touch base and um, you know just let you know that I'm not saying that it's the parents' fault the ones that did what they the ones that did the best that they could do in raising them, especially if you were single parents, um, you know, please don't take the other video that I made that I'm saying, well, if you did what you're supposed to do, they would never go up and get into trouble or do wrong. Because that's not what I'm saying. That's the furthest thing I'm saying. I'm saying about them being unruly in public and running around through the restaurants and, you know, the stores and things. I'm just trying to say... You know, if you're one of the parents that let them do whatever they wanted from age one, you know, through their adulthood, then yeah, they're more amped to go and do, continue doing what they want and thinking there's no, there's no consequences to it. But, you know, I'm talking about the parents that have been there no matter what for their kids and done what they could have done and loved them and tried to teach them right from wrong. Sometimes the kids are still, you know, once you raise them to where they're of legal age, you can't, you could can talk to them. You can try to tell them, look, the road you're going down isn't the right road. You know, you need to stop and think about what you're doing. You weren't raised this way. But sometimes it doesn't work. It, it, it just doesn't. And I know that from experience. So, you know, I just wanted to touch base one, one quick time and let you know that um, by no means am I saying if your kids grow up and get yourself in trouble or in jail, you know, that it's the parents' fault. And I know a lot of times, because I felt that I failed in a lot of ways, and that's why I said I'm not the perfect parent. If there was things that I could change, believe me, I would change. Um, so I just wanted to touch base and do a little bit of a part two um, about the Keeping It Real series, part one, that I just made about unruly kids. Um, so anyway, I hope you're all having a good weekend. And uh, if you like this kind of video, maybe you click the like, share, comment, subscribe button. I'd appreciate it. Um, till we talk again, take care. Bye.